In this video, we're going to be trying on four dog Halloween costumes and giving them a rating from 1 to 10. Let's jump in! Hi friends! This is Teddy's first Halloween, so we're going all out. You're going to get to see the process of putting each costume on Teddy, and we'll be giving each one a rating based on personal preference. The first costume we're trying on is a wizard set, and it brings a cape and pointy hat. I got this one on Amazon, so I'll put the link in the description in case you want to get it too. This material kind of feels like the material of a waterproof baby bib. I love the print on it and how much it stands out. I don't know if I'm not tying the strings tight enough, but they keep getting loose, and then the whole thing starts flipping over and Teddy tries to bite it, but that just might be user error. The hat is adorable, but I'm having to put it behind his ears, otherwise it falls off. Overall, he can move easily and seems comfortable. The only thing I wish this costume had was another string around the middle or bottom of the cape that I could tie to make sure that it didn't keep falling to one side. Other than that, I actually love this costume. We give this one an 8 out of 10. The next costume we're trying on is simply a bow tie collar. I believe I got this one on Timu, so I don't have a link for you guys, but with how little I paid, it seems like it's very good quality. Is it just me, or does Teddy look super handsome in his tux collar? This one was the simplest and of course the most comfortable for him. I love how formal he looks like he's ready for work or prom. I like that it doesn't have to be worn just on Halloween. Anytime we go somewhere fancy, he's gonna be wearing this. The only issue is that I guess I got too big of a size, so it overlaps a little bit in the back. Other than that, I give this one a 9 out of 10. Next, we have the Superman costume. I got this one on Amazon, so I'll drop the link for you guys below. So far, this one looks like it's the best quality costume. The colors are vibrant, and the material of each piece seems carefully thought out. This one brings multiple pieces being the cape, the chest, and I guess a belt. The S is a foamy fabric, and the cape is a really soft, thin fabric. Perfect for moving with the wind. I didn't want to put the belt on him because he's already got too many things tied to his body, but I think the purpose is to cover up the strings that show from the cape. Something I preferred in the other costumes is the use of Velcro, which I think makes putting it on easier, but I see the benefit of having the strings since it's much more adjustable to different sizes. What I love about it is that the cape has strings to tie around his belly, not just around his neck. This is perfect for making it stay in place. I give this one a 10 out of 10. And finally, the funniest one. This is a pirate costume that only goes on his front legs, making him look like a tiny person. I got this one on Timu, which I think you might be able to tell based on the poor quality. The illusion is definitely obvious in this one, and I find it hilarious. Like I said, I don't think the quality is great. The body parts seem like a hard stuffed animal, and the clothing part feels like a really cheap material. The colors are also not very vibrant. The hat is not secure at all and can easily fall off. I may have gotten him too small of a size because it feels really tight on him. On the website, I think their model was a cat, so maybe that's why it's so tight on Teddy. As you can see, he doesn't really feel like moving when he's wearing this. From far, I love it, but as a practical costume, I don't think I'll be putting this one on him. I can't imagine that it's comfortable. I give this costume a 6 out of 10. For Halloween, we will definitely be using Teddy's Superman costume, since he seems comfy in it and it looks great. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. Let me know in the comments how you're dressing up your fur baby this Halloween. Happy spooky season! Bye!